All right, this is Scumbag Flanders coming at you from the heart of Houston, Texas. Uh, just a, a little uh, local history for me. Anyways, I'm kind of in, I don't know what you want to call this, the Heights area. So across the street here, where all those lights are, that's uh, some kind of... Uh, Burger Shack called BB's, I guess. A little drinkery, burger, something, whatever. And so next to it is kind of an empty parking lot. And then you got Jimmy's Ice Hole, I mean house, over there. Anyway, so back in the old days, when we're talking 30 years ago plus, uh, that used to be a Texaco gas station that my grandparents owned. And you can see, I don't know if you can see, uh, Sort of in the middle of the screen there, there's like uh, steps to go up to the roof. I think that's part of the original building. But literally, it used to be just like a little convenience uh, gas station uh, transmission. Little, you know, minor repair kind of place. That my grandparents actually lived in. And we would, me and my sister, uh, when we were little, you know, would stay over there. The, the main office, you know, they didn't really sell like... Like, like today, you know, Cokes and uh, candies and chips and whatnot. Uh, it was just kind of like, you know, a regular office with a desk or whatever. And it had a couch that folded into, you know, a hideaway bed or whatever. But anyways, so that was where they lived. This is where my grandparents lived. And, and it was their business. And they had, uh, uh, alt, uh, alt, what's it called? Um, can't think of the word. But uh, they did tire repairs, you know, and transmissions and um, alternator, that's it, alternator electrical work and stuff. So then uh, eventually, um, you know, their their sons uh, bought the place out from them and uh, after my grandpa died, who, who actually died on that property, uh, just more information. But anyways, next to it, uh, in this kind of parking lot, it used to be a house that uh, my uncle used to live in. Uh, uh, and actually, they, they, I guess they still own the property, so they rent it out or lease it out to these people here. And I guess they make a lot of money. This area is kind of an up-and-coming place. Um, but anyways, that's a quick little history. So here, this place, Fitzgerald's, named after Ella Fitzgerald's, um, is a Houston institution as far as uh, music goes. It's um, a venue that uh, many famous people have played and not so famous um but uh you know local local types uh, play here all the time and so my friend uh, that i work with uh her uh solo act called la catrine is playing here tonight this is her cd release party so i'm about to go in and check it out so i'll be making reports from time to time all right scumbag flanders signing off choose oh.